Lots of clouds building, the heat is building too, and some of the skies are opening up with thunder showers, but not at the moment in Birmingham over downtown. But notice we do have that line expected in between about two and five for thunderstorms to develop. So check it out. This is our WBTM 13 live Doppler radar all in real time. Here are the lucky folks around Double Springs. Highway 278 to into Arley, so not the best idea to be out at Smith Lake today because we could potentially have some lightning bolts. We do have our lightning detection system enabled right now. We just aren't seeing any with that particular particular cluster from Pelham areas of I-65 and 119 getting a good soaking. A lot of folks around Highway 31 headed towards Columbiana are getting a bit more too. But notice as we zoom out, we see a lot less detail with the satellite and radar composite as opposed to our WVTM 13 live Doppler. So we do give you that closer inspection, but this shows that we have a whole lot of humidity coming up from the south, but we don't have anything really well organized. We're keeping our eyes closely on a couple of tropical features. Certainly one a little closer to home at Puerto Rico, impacted by a low pressure center that's not expected to develop into anything tropical, but it will be a big rainmaker for southern Florida and areas of the Bahamas. Next up on deck is a tropical wave off the coast of Africa that the National Hurricane Center has a much higher probability of becoming a tropical depression by the time we get towards the end of the week. So for us right now, we're seeing spotty showers on our radar in our northwest Alabama counties. That's why I like this forecast model. It still shows spotty showers, a possibility for all of us through at least 8 p.m., but disorganized. We lose all that green on the map as we head towards tomorrow morning, but by tomorrow afternoon, this stalled out boundary starts to ignite a few more thunderstorms in the afternoon between about three, maybe even holding on through six. Sun goes down, rain chances do as well. Right now, temperature is 87 degrees. We have a hot wind out of the west at six miles per hour, and it's pretty muggy out there enough that it brings our feels like condition to 91 degrees in Birmingham. It feels like 95 in Tuscaloosa. It feels like 97 degrees right now in Fayette. So the feels like condition, probably best to be out there on the mountain bike with a little bit of that breeze. But keep in mind, we have a chance for a thunder shower to develop. A lot of folks will see it more widely scattered when we get to the hottest part of the day. So in your seven day forecast, we have those rain chances each day, but they do look a lot more widespread over the next couple of days because we're underneath that stalled out boundary so your forecast for today still holds a chance for rain. So if it hasn't rained at your house yet, don't give up hope. It, do, it does look like we'll have a few more thunderstorms by five.